the engines on the island of Sodos. Gordon is a very good express. Percy is good at carrying the mail. And when Edward is not hauling freight cars, he likes taking the from the behind. He's very good at being a back engine. When engines have heavy loads, Edward buffers. Hurry up, hurry up, chuffed Gordon crossly. But Edward is unreliable. Some engines think this makes him old. Edward is a useless old... Gordon sniffed. He should be retired. But he doesn't have tires, Percy said. Wake up, you lazy cow! Retired, said Thomas, means takes from behind... Too soon, said Gordon. And the other big engines agreed with him. But Percy was very upset. Later, his driver asked him why he looked so glum. Percy told him about Edward. The big engines don't think he's useful anymore, he said. Percy's driver saw Percy and told him what Percy had said. Oh, really? Excuse me. Uh. <laughs> Sir Topham had had a plan. The new step line is completed, he said to Edward. I want you to teach Loopney how to run it properly. But, sir, who will look after the f duck will do your work? Sir Topham had replied. But, sir, who will duck will do your work? But, sir, duck will do your work. When the other engines heard duck was going to help them, they were pleased. Duck is very unreliable, said Henry. It makes no difference to me, said Gordon pompously. I don't need a bag. And he wished away. Edward enjoyed working with Stepney. It was great fun delivering passengers to stations in the beautiful countryside. But Duck was not happy. The trucks were playing their silly games. Duck should play with other trucks because he's good at pulling ducks. Quack, quack, ow, ow, hold back, ow, boy. They giggled. <laughs> Duck found himself going slower and slower and slower and slower and slower and slower and slower. Halfway up Gordon's Hill, his wheels stopped altogether. Duck was duck. Oh no, said his driver. This is Duck's line. Gordon's guard phoned the signalman to warn him. It's too late to switch Duck into the middle line, said the signalman. You'll have to switch Duck into the middle line. Gordon saw the guard, but Gordon ignored the guard. If I stop on this hill, I'll never get started again, he said crossly. Gordon tried to set off again, but his wheels spun and spun and spun and spun and spun. It's no use. We need a bat, said the driver. I'll send for Ed. Ed. Gordon was excited. Edward was cross. He was going to be the back engine for duck, duck, duck. trains. Edward cheerfully buffered up and the strange train set off. Hurry up, hurry up, chuffed Gordon crossly. Look at that, laughed a boy. The bat must be the strongest and the best. Gordon spoke severely to Sir Topham Hat. Sir Topham Hat was embarrassed. The Gordon. You have said rude things about Edward Edward. He proved today that he is very ashamed. Gordon felt useful, reliable, and very helpful. The next morning. Gordon apologized. Thank you for helping me, Edward, puffed Gordon. You really are a useful engine. It's good to be back, Edward chuffed happily. No.